Saber Septic System. Uh, we're here today to uh, demonstrate an installation of the Saber Septic, which is a process that modifies a standard septic treatment plant so that it will improve the effluent, what comes out of the septic tank, uh, and to protect the environment. It's a much more uh, efficient system than a standard anaerobic treatment concept, and it will uh, definitely improve the quality of the water that is being sent on to a leach field or wherever they're going to do for uh, further treatment. We have the equipment that goes down inside this tank. Normally, it would be, in, it would be installed in a, a septic tank, either a single compartment or dual compartment or even a tri-compartment type tank. Um, oh, the, the crux of what we're doing is adding air to the septic waste coming from the houses. And by aerating it, you improve the digestion uh, much more efficiently, much quicker, and much thorough, and more thorough. And uh, it's, it's, a, um, it's a real innovation to, uh, to use in, uh, in the home septic treatment concept. All right, we now have a shot of the uh, looking down inside the treatment tank. And inside this tank, we have installed uh, air diffusers, uh, an air diffuser so that uh, there is a little blower that's inside the control panel, and that blower will force air down into the um, into the liquid and uh, add oxygen out of the air and mix up the solution so that it is thoroughly uh, and, uh, and, and anaerobically uh, digested and will do a complete job of removing the organics uh, and tying up the solids with the organics. Uh, that happens on a, on a cycle basis for Say over a 24 hour period, we use four cycles of six hours. So we will blow air through the diffuser into the, into the sewage for approximately five hours. And then the timer will shut the air blower off and it will then allow the solids to settle down because there's no mixing. You have static conditions in there and so the solids then will settle downward and the clear liquid will be on top and as you have seen down in there or you can see perhaps there is a red pump and after the five hour aeration and a 45 minute rest period for the solids to settle the pump is energized and then the the liquid the clear liquid on top will be pumped onto a on-grade system, is that what it's called? At-grade at grade system for further uh, uh, treatment and for distribution of percolation into the ground. Uh, this pump will operate simply on a, uh, on a float arrangement and it'll only pump down so far and it'll need to pump four or five cycles a day and it will then uh, after it's pumped down, the floats will, the level sensors will shut the pump off and then the air blower will come on in a few minutes and you wind up just starting another cycle. So you wind up having, uh, just redoing the same thing over and over again. And it's called a sequencing batch reactor, which means you aerate for a while you discharge for a while, and you do it uh, over several sequences over the day. Uh, and it's, uh, it's a tried and true concept. It's been around for 40 years. We've just learned a clever way to apply it to septic tanks. Um, the clever thing is, is there uh, is a control panel which has all the control functions of the blower, the, the pump, the cycles, and everything. With the aeration and the pumping, you are what they call pulse dosing, which is the much better way of handling um, 
uh, distribution and disposal of uh, sewage out of a septic tank. Pulse dosing is a very tried and true concept and what is really being accepted all the way across the country. And uh, our system incorporates that to improve the, the total overall uh, reduction of organics and solids out in the, out in the, uh, uh, in the leach fields. Basically what we've done here is a little un more unusual in that we have two houses that is going into this. These two houses already have septic tanks that are here. And these two houses now uh, combine and come into this 750 gallon tank which we are using for an aeration and pump tank. Um, and uh, it's unusual to have two homes into the same system. But uh, whether it's an individual or multiple homes, you can, uh, uh, you can set it up as long as you just take into consideration of what the design conditions are and, uh, and it'll work quite well. One of the uh, primary benefits of this, or there's several, um, is that it's a very simple arrangement. You already have a septic tank there and not normally you can just go ahead and utilize the existing septic tank you have. As long as the tank is, you know, sound and doesn't leak and so on and so forth, uh, you can just simply install our equipment right down in the existing septic tank. Uh, likewise, if you put a new septic tank in, uh, it's good to have a dual compartment tank uh, using one for the solid settled and the other for the aeration and pumping. Um, and uh, it's a very inexpensive system compared to other types of ATUs that are out there. Uh, they can be very expensive and with ours we have found that we can uh, we can be as much as 25% uh, uh, as of the cost of those. Uh, but still um, uh, you get the same good, efficient uh, uh, aeration and clarification and a much less, much less cost but an even more assured fact that you're removing the solids because uh, you don't have some of the other problems that are uh, inherent to some of the other systems.